Assalamu alaikum my name is Muhammad Ilyas and welcome to my channel today in how to videos I will teach you how you can compile Nginx from source code on a CentOS server there's a many other web server application available uh, such as Apache and as extra but I'm choosing Nginx here because Nginx has a many uh, many other facilities available uh, like uh, load balancing content caching uh, security control and memory management one more thing <laughs> that attract me that uh, uh, nginx is used by many top giant website like wordpress.com soundcloud uh, techcrunch and is the discovery.com or dropbox github you can visit nginx.com and uh, check more think about nginx okay i will here i move on to first of all you need uh, a virtual machine for your uh, centos virtual machine for your compilation uh, i am choose i am using a digital ocean so vm because uh, because digital ocean is very fast uh, because uh, it create very fast droplet for me uh, rather than adi uh, rather than other software uh, rather than other vm provider you can use your own computer and create your own uh, centos machine on virtual virtual box and any other software okay i'm creating my droplet uh, okay my droplet is installing this video okay my virtual machine is successfully created and i have connected with my git bash uh you can use a pretty and any other software okay first of all you need to update your virtual machine okay you can you can use the following command it takes some time i will be resume when it completed okay and now now you have to install all the dependencies uh, package that you need uh, that is important for your source code compilation i will post it all the code in uh, below the below the video so you can copy paste it okay this installation takes some time to okay first of all you need to download a source code from source uh, you can use this link uh, op i will post it all the links in a text area so you can copy paste it uh, you need to j right click on it i'm using uh, version 1.9.15 right click and open your terminal again and t type wget and paste the link okay link is copy paste now now you have to unzip this file just type ls to see the file is all i have already unzipped this file so you uh, when you unzip untar your file you can see this type of folder okay for unzip uh, untar use the following command tar x okay this command uh, unzip the file i have already uh, unzip it so i do not okay now you have to enter in a file okay i'm in my file now you have to configure uh configure for the configuration you have to uh, just copy paste these command i'm using these command because uh because i already told that the uh, nginx is very big software it contain more uh, uh, it contain thousands of modules uh, so by this command we can choose uh, our 
are you can i am using here are important modules which are useful for my project you can uh, you can check your useful by by the following command i will show you how can you can how can you choose the important module how can you see the important module okay this configuration takes some time i will resume when it completed welcome back my configuration is completed now now you have to just type make command this command compile all the file this this compilation takes some time i will resume when it completed my compilation is completed now now you have to just install uh, your compilation by just by this command make install this installation also takes some time i will resume when it complete congratulations your engine x is compiled and installed into your server now now you just two to three step away from your goal just you need to edit one file because every time when you restart your server you need uh, your web server is automatically start so you need to edit uh, init file Okay, I am in init folder. Now you have to create one file here, which name is nginx. You 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 have now you have to edit this file. You can uh, you can use your your own text editor what you like to use. I am using here Nano, which is very easy to use. now you have to open this link in your browser and copy paste all the code from it i will post it all the links down below the videos just paste it here okay uh, press control x and press yes to save this file okay file is saved now now you have to uh, copy both both uh, command and just paste it on your terminal okay great all the file is uh, all the configuration is completed now one thing i will forget here you have to you have to change the permission of uh, file to executable mode okay all the configuration is complete now and one last thing uh, that is very important for your engine x software you need to configure engine x configuration file sorry you need to edit your engine x configuration file because uh, it is very important for your system i am using nano again here uh you have to find this these line hh http 
and here you have to uh, here you have to la to, uh, have to change this sorry you have to copy these uh, line and just paste it in this file okay now save again yes okay now you have to restart your server sorry start your server give me some error uh, the problem is you have to create a new user with the, with the name is with the name engine x Okay, I and now by this command you can add new user. Now you have to uh, you have to paste this code again, and you can run your server by typing just this command. Congratulations, your server is ready to use now. You can go to this directory and edit your file. HTML folder. Here is your main directory where the all the file is saved. Now you can check your server by going uh, by by entering IP address. Sorry. Okay. Uh, you can see that just my server is working now. Thank you for watching my video. You if you have any problem with this uh, compilation, you can just comment below. And I, inshallah, I will resume all the errors. Or you can search on uh, Stack Overflow. Thank you for watching once again.